Okay, I'll make a proper video about this later. But I just discovered that if everything is set up right, meaning... Okay, well first I'll say what I'm doing. I have been a long-time lover of Windows Media Center. And after hearing that it was being removed from Windows 10, I have been looking for ways to mm, fix it. So this is my computer with Windows 10 running on it. As you can see, Steam is running, and on the same network, I have a computer that is running Windows 8.1 with Media Center. On that computer, I added the e -shell ehshell.exe that's in the eHome folder in the Windows folder in your main drive. That is Media Center. And I have that, added that to Steam as a quote-unquote game. So... If, as long as I'm logged into Steam on the same user account on this computer that's running Windows 10 and other stuff like the host machine is has only one monitor and it is the same resolution as this monitor, I can hit Stream and this is Windows Media Center running on Windows 10, sort of, with live TV working just fine and not just local stuff but okay that's just my cable signal being bad but and the, it's not a perfect solution there is yeah Again, my cable signal is not the best. I have to look into that. But once it gets going... Okay, maybe I was not entirely... This was working a lot better earlier. But, as you can see, this is HD cable in Media Center on a Windows 10 PC. It's not the best solution. It's not running natively. I don't know how if I can run this in a window. But this is this as I know how to do it right now. Um, if you think this is interesting, leave a like. Have questions, leave comments. As I said, I'll make a better video of this later. But as always, God bless and have a great day.